Hello, my name is Karx82, and welcome back to my Project Zone 3 Kappa Mode playthrough. Just been crafting up a few more of the solar panels so we can get the third one here. So I need like the three more. And as I was looking up the piston recipe, I noticed <laughs> I look in there and there's actually a much cheaper recipe. It's just some copper and redstone. I don't even need to do anything. You can just do the dust if you want. So instead of the eight redstone that I was doing, I actually had an easier way to get that. So just thought I would point that out. So I'm probably going to need a whole bunch of this, so let me just do that. And uh... here we go. We'll get some more um, redstone alloy. For the yeah the pistons, invar. Do we have invar? We have a few. I only need three though. Right. Yeah. So let's go ahead and get this. All of that. All right. Is there like workbenches in this? Or something that. A workbench. Uh, what are they called? Work table. Is that what the. Uh... I can't remember what the. Is there even forestry even in this? Forest. Oh, it doesn't look like uh, forestry is in this. No, it's not. All right. Well, that's good to know. We should have. All right. Yeah, I gotta figure out if there's like a before we get auto crafting, maybe there is a way to kind of save recipes so we don't have to go over and over again. But there is that, and there is that. So we have three of those, and then we need what do we need for the next one? We need a block of iron. Pretty sure the only way we can do blocks of iron right now is in here. Yeah, I don't think there's any other way. I don't have that factor as a factor factorizer. Yeah, I don't have this yet, which I mean, it's super easy to make. I should just make it. Because that would be quicker. I've heard it doesn't use power, so not sure if that is true, but. So what does this need? Stone, sticks and redstone. I like how there's a I like that recipe. That uh, you don't need to do the torches, you can just do it like that. Yeah, that's like a really cool recipe, I like that. So we got the repeater, we're gonna get the block of iron, and then these. So I just need, I said it was iron and some glass, right? And then we need a few of these and more glass. Oh, not that one. Any glass, yeah. So just to, basically just a whole bunch of glass. So we'll get the three from that and then we will get the, that. Oh, we only get one of those. Ew, okay, just kidding. All right, so we're gonna need, we got two. Man, I'm getting so messed up with all these, uh... <laughs> like, we get two solar panels from that. We only get one from this, but we get three from that. Like, oh, well, it's not difficult. It's just it's kind of funny. It's messed me up a bit. So what do we need? We need just a little bit less of that. Yeah, because that's the six. And then that. And is that. It's almost everything. We just need the block of iron. The to there. I put everything in there, right? Yeah. Yeah, I 
I love that progress bar. And I guess this, we'll just break this. All right, and then that will be the, is it 64 or is it 32? I can't remember. 32. Not the best, but uh, yeah, I'll take it. We actually get two of these, actually. Yeah, we get two, so we get 64. That, do all these give, oh, all those recipes give, these two don't, but it looks like every one other one, you actually get two from that. That's actually pretty cool. All right, so there we go. We got two solar panels. So we'll just throw them there. Yeah, and there we go. We are charging up our uh, energy cell. Oh, and the energy cells, I completely forgot there are the, the upgrade things. What are they called again? A I go under is it epsilon no can never just looking at them ada yeah it's under ada yeah the inver upgrades yeah this is how you upgrade the things um that's why i couldn't find the recipe all right uh but let me kind of figure out what we want to do for the rest of this episode today i'm thinking I want to get some like storage because this isn't gonna work <laughs> um i kind of want to the first kind of thing i want to get doing going is infinite resources and get that whole thing set up is kind of my main goal here in the very beginning of this pack so i won't have to worry about resources ever again it's kind of what my goal here um starting out is all right so what i'm kind of thinking uh at first um i think i want i'll probably just set up like pulverizing stuff down into some sieves and then probably into a storage system i'm i'm thinking compact drawers maybe Yeah, maybe do a whole thing of drawers and then we could just have one for like each type maybe and just let it kind of run and fill up as needed. Um, eventually I would like everything to be auto processed down into like ingots or whatever. I mean, obviously these won't be processed down, but um, like all the different pieces I want to get auto processed um, but I think before we do that, I kind of just want to get like a whole kind of setup for that. Although I was looking at this, uh, these barrels and there is the, the quest and I noticed there's actually an infinite tier. So I don't know if would that be silly just to have this running infinitely and just filling up barrels. I mean, that seems a bit silly. I probably have a void upgrade maybe. But, I mean, actually, actually, now that I'm thinking about it, I actually don't know how difficult the Kappa mode is to kind of complete. I don't, do we need millions of uh, resources? I actually don't know. So maybe just getting that going as early as possible and just pumping all this stuff into infinite drawers, maybe? They didn't look that difficult to make, actually. It's basically just an upgrade with some stuff around it like that's it and you have infinite capacity I'm okay maybe we'll do that I think I may just convince myself to do that and I've never actually used this mod so maybe do a different a different mod for a change uh it does look like there is a connecting thing so I think this is like a drawer controller from the storage yeah I think if that's like the the only thing hmm, the only thing that's like better oh nice you can change the look with a barrel hammer didn't know that 
Um, the only thing that's cool about these is they have compacting drawers, and I'm pretty sure those work on the these. So I think that would feed into it, and they would compact them down into this. So that would be like the only kind of thing that I think would be. Item smelting. You could smelt the stuff going in there. Collect pickups. What is this? What does that do? Collect pickups. Hmm. I should like really check out what this mod is. <laughs> barrel wrench, barrel painter, barrel hammer. What barrel wrench do? Should look at these first. All right, that's easy. Just slab paper in a chest. That's not bad. Oh, you get 16 of them. I don't know. Should we try that at first? If uh, I decide to change my mind. At some point, I do want all these pieces compacted down, but I don't think I can do that quite yet. Um, we need infinity dust, so grains of infinity, and I don't know how I'm going to get this either, because there is no bedrock in a void world. But I did really quickly... There is a thing for it, like right there, and you need mob farming, and that is... Here, so maybe I'll do this and see what it says. The quests, I don't know if it's going to tell me anything. The, uh, the quests are pretty... <laughs> it doesn't do go a whole lot of explaining. Some of them do, but a lot of them... Like this, it just says, look at the manual. <laughs> so, um, alright, I guess let me... Like, this... How am I going to do this? I guess item ducks into into the thing so it could start sifting. But I don't, I want to get everything kind of set up before I have it auto. Yeah, until I start sifting thousands of things here because we're already like almost full. And I have had to manually do this stuff because uh, this is full. So I guess, yeah, let me. Let me build, I'm gonna, I really don't feel like moving that. <laughs> uh, I guess I don't have to move it. What am I talking about? Cause this I, has a huge radius. I probably could lift this up and it would still be fine. And then I could pipe out. Well, this could pipe out, All right. Is that what I wanna do? Anyway, let me cut here so I'm not just rambling on doing nothing, and we'll come back. Okay, I've kind of figured out what I think I want to do, and I need some paper. don't have any paper. Well, thankfully we have tons of sugar here. Fortunately, this is probably going to like fall off the side, isn't it? Uh, maybe I should... Um, do a little bit of... Pan this out just a little bit. I should have done this before I started recording, but oh well. I'll just do it like. Well, I have no idea how much. Is the sugar cane gonna like fall all over the place? Who knows? Yeah, let's just do one more. And I also have no idea what happens if I fall in the the void. Is there like forgiving death kind of thing? We don't know. All right, so let's see. It falls out just a little bit. It's not too too crazy. Um, probably don't need three of those though. I gotta find a better place to put that uh, sugar cane. Ooh, how about that? And I also gotta get a better storage system here. For sure. Um, Anyway, I want to get this item barrel connector and check out how this works. So I need that. It's 16 of those, which is pretty cool. Yes. Oh, well, it's I know it's like wasting. We do it that way, but well, all right, so item barrel collector. So I moved, I moved that from over here, 
And the cool thing about these barrels is they keep their inventory uh, when you break them. So that is pretty cool. I'm just going to put it there. And I don't know how this works, but uh, how about we do that? That work. So what happens if we put that in there? Didn't even actually see. <laughs> so 40. I'm assuming it went in there, but... 42 yeah all right and then i'm assuming if we add more barrels um they will connect now i don't know the range of this or anything does it uh i don't think it says pretty sure it didn't see it say anything works somewhat the same as drawer controllers all right so it sort of works like drawer controllers good to know I do like you get tons of these blank upgrades. That's really cool. All right, I guess. Uh... Yeah, I'll just have to kind of set up. Just trying to think, how do I want to do this? So I definitely need. I'll probably just feed the pulverizer into the until this thing is what I'm kind of thinking. Just feed it directly in. So I gotta figure out a better place for this. Unfortunately, I do since I'm doing solar, I kinda need it like up top. Or at least in view of the sun, so I can't put it underneath. So that's a bit awkward, but item ducks. Item ducks. Item ducks. But yeah, just regular. It does need that hard. Can I Actually, now I'm thinking about it. No, I can't. I need a induction smelter. I was like, can I use that alloy thing for that? But didn't think so. But regular item ducks. Yeah, just some tin and lead. That's super easy. All right, that's probably full already, isn't it? Probably shouldn't have put that whole thing in, but I'll just kind of have these in my inventory so I know how many things I need to set up. So I guess I'm thinking just a barrel for every item, I guess. I, that's probably what I'm going to have to do. So yeah, I'm just going to have to kind of figure out how many, well, I can actually look. Um, so for doing gravel, basically I'm going to need one for Every single one of these. What's how many is in this row? Seven, fourteen, so sixteen. And then do we need sand? Sand give anything unique? It does give this stuff and electrotine. Cocoa beans. No, oh, but diamond stiffen won't. So I don't need to worry about that. So I guess. What did I say? Oh my goodness, I already forgot. So 16, 17, 18, 19. I think I would, because these are all the same as the other ones. And dust, I probably will have to sieve as well, because you get redstone from that. Oh man, we got a whole bunch of extra stuff from this. So 19, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. I need about 25, 26 barrels here. Uh, so I can sift absolutely everything and uh, not worry about inventories getting clogged up or anything. So I guess, yeah, I guess I'm just going to have to get to craft in here. Thankfully, it's just wood and slabs. What was that? Oh, cool. You can do. Okay, would that be cheaper? Let me think here. So you get 16 from that. And I can get... Yeah, that would actually be cheaper if I did that way, wouldn't it? Because I can get eight... Get eight chests, basically, from this. Let's see here. So if we do this... Yeah, that's 32 chests. Yeah, that's much cheaper. Although I do need to craft some more blank upgrades, but that's easy enough. Oh, you can... Okay, so this does is any slab. All right, I didn't realize it was any slab. 
How many did I say I needed? How about 30? There we go. Well, that was easy. <laughs> All right. Um, what ends if we place this like that? All right. It'll just automatically go in. And then if I want, I can lock. And is it? I can't remember what I had on here. Yeah, those two. I don't want the display bar. That just shows, I mean, it shows you how full it is. Do I want that? I don't know. Maybe I do want that. Actually, I kind of like that. Instead of the actual number, just kind of be like, oh, I need a lot. But I definitely do need, definitely want, I guess we'll just do all. Oh, I'm like really close to the edge. All right, I guess, uh, yeah, let me just do this and I'm gonna build out the thing and I gotta figure out, or at least find out how far the item barrel connector works. So let me figure that out and we will be right back. All right, we're back. And when did I make some mini chests? I must have <laughs> like then not realized, but so basically I have just set up a whole bunch of chests over here and I'm just realizing now Never lit this up. I've had monsters spawning, but thankfully I wasn't far enough away. When they can spawn up there, it looks like it's well. And I I did a bit of googling, but I couldn't find out um, doing that because <laughs> the uh, the range on that thing is so big. I couldn't find out how the range on the item or the barrel connector. So I'll probably just do four up. Going up any higher, I don't I don't usually like going up higher than four. I'll probably just extend it out and we'll kind of see how far they get. And basically I was just taking everything I kind of got while sifting and was just filling everything up. Just kind of throwing it in here and seeing uh, <laughs> what happened. Oh, I just noticed that as well. Yeah, and there's also, if you notice those pieces, I don't know if I'm going to do those pieces actually. Like, well, no, I'm probably going to need it at some point, so might as well. And I'm pretty sure, well, I don't know for sure. But I'm guessing that there is some way to kind of like one of those tools that's in this mod will copy all the all the settings. I'm guessing, but I just haven't tested it out. But it does look like the it does go up four, and I just added these, so that's why that there aren't in there. But yeah, I'm still not completely sold on the. A bar. I think after a while, once this has been running for a while, I actually don't think it's going to matter, to be honest. Uh, all right, uh, so this, I think we're going to need. Does this? Man, I can't remember. This doesn't auto input. Oh, it does. Hmm. All right, that's a thing. And this goes, I would like a, I'm just trying to decide, should I just throw this on that? I don't know if this is quite what I want yet, but I don't know, throw that there. Does that go automatically? Yeah, it does. I'll probably move this over here though. Once I get this kind of all sorted out, I guess we could throw all this stuff in. That, no, I don't need that. Yeah, I don't know about the, if I'm gonna be sifting, well, I probably will be sifting this stuff up. And this is just gonna take me a little while to sort out everything. But most of the stuff we'll just have, yeah. And I'll rearrange these. I'll probably put all the pieces 
kind of together and stuff. But for now, it's just kind of going in. However, but I am pretty happy with that, I guess, so far. Now this setup, I think we're going to have to move to like over here. Where is this thing again? It is right under there. Just that's is there anything in that? I have no idea. I didn't ever even try like digging into it. Is there something in the center? Watch this probably like some amazing chest in the center that I didn't even know about. Yeah, it would help if I had an axe, but why would I do things the easy way? Yeah. How do I want to do this? I don't need the hopper. I think you can just pipe in directly into that, I think. Alright, so actually, let's, let's do that. So now this is pulling 40, but since I have the two, we're actually we're good on that. Um, also, are there mufflers for this? <laughs> Maybe I can turn the machines down. Machine sounds down somehow. Um, oh, do I want to do this? I'm thinking really should craft up the, the tool. What if I do that? Let's get some... Was it lead and tin? I don't remember. I don't think it needs to be anything fancy starting out. Is it? Is it this? Yeah. Actually, probably. Probably only need six. Let's. This is just kind of rudimentary. I just kind of want to get a bit of automation going so I can have it running while I am doing other stuff. So I don't want that coming out that side. I want red on the bottom, and maybe yellow on that side into that thing once I finally empty it up. But I, I think that'll, yeah, that should work, right? Yeah. Oh, I should probably hook it up to the power. Let's just throw one in there and see what happens. Well, it got pulled out. Did it get pulled in there? I actually didn't notice, to be honest. Yeah, all right, so there it is. All right, so. I guess, um, yeah, I'll just set this up like right here. That on top, maybe? What happens if I do... Just kind of curious. What happens if I do that as well? Does that fill up, like, both? What do I want to put? All right, maybe I'll do that. And then I just have a supply of... I don't know why I would need a supply of cobblestone, but... Yeah, we'll do that. All right, so very rudimentary kind of... Uh, automation, uh, resource generation, I should say, not automation, but I can get rid of that chest. And that will just, I'll fill that up and that'll just kind of be that. Although, yeah, that might be, that might have to fill that up first. So I'm thinking this will just auto output. To the right. Yeah, that should auto well put sand into here if it needs it. All right, and these were from Sifting, right? Yeah, another. See, this is. Oh, Prosperity Shards. Is this the only way I can get it? I think I can get it from that as well. All right, because we're definitely going to need these at some point. All right, so I should probably just put everything. 
let's just do that instead of like umming and eyeing about it. I also did see, I saw something that required that paradot actually, and I can't remember what it was. A machine of some sort. Oh, yeah, drawer controller. It needs that paradot, it looks like. But I actually ended up not doing the drawer controller. Because, I mean, this needs batteries and sulfur and all sorts of stuff, whereas this didn't. <laughs> so, alright. Well, I'm kind of happy with this so far. And we'll just, yeah, basically build up some resources. I'm going to switch out all those the meshes to diamond. See, this is the issue. I can't see how many we have. Oh, if I hit shift, it does. All right. Yeah, I'm okay. I'm happy with that. I am happy with that. So, yep, this is going. Hopefully once that fills up, it will, uh, I should have it only on, now that I'm looking at this, maybe only have it on the, uh, the diamond ones. I don't think there is any reason not to have it on those. There's gonna be room for those. I can't remember if I had enough barrels. Anyway, uh, that's going to be it for this episode. Next episode, uh, I'm not sure where we want to go. Uh, I think I'm actually just not 100% sure about the progression kind of in the pack. Um, I'll have to kind of take a look. And I was kind of looking at like the end game stuff because I usually like to have kind of like an end game goal. And oh, I just noticed that. So that's just a whole bunch of different quests it looks like all sorts of different stuff and yeah like the end i feel like this should go back to the quest but anyway like these it just says all the quests so i'm not sure like yeah i'm not sure what all the quests mean if it's like is there a certain amount of quests that we need for these seeds i'm guessing like seeds would be you know, maybe all these quests, but I actually don't know. But uh, I don't know, maybe we'll get into some of this next episode. Not sure. Anyway, that's going to be it for this episode. So thanks for watching and have a good one.